to my travel vlog. In this episode, I'm going to share my Norwegian cruise line itinerary. Uh, I flew from Florida to Copenhagen and from there I took the Norwegian cruise line. It is recommended to get to the cruise line destination a day or two days early just in case flight delays or for any other unexpected problems. In Copenhagen, we stayed at AC Hotel by Marriott Bella Sky Copenhagen. This hotel features distinctive and modern architecture. And here is how the hotel room looks like. The view from AC by Marriott in Copenhagen. We reached Copenhagen in the afternoon, so decided to explore Nyhaven in the evening. I can't stop myself from talking about Copenhagen's bike culture. Really impressive. Life in Copenhagen is lived in the saddle of a bicycle. Everybody does it. Copenhageners love their bikes. Cycling is fast, convenient, healthy, climate friendly, enjoyable and cheap. Although Copenhageners honestly love their bikes no matter their financial income, even top politicians ride their bike every day to parliament. Actually there are more bikes than inhabitants in Copenhagen. 375 kilometers of cycle tracks and traffic is light, lights that are coordinated in favor of cyclists during rush hour. While motorists sit in tailbacks, cyclists tend to sweep through the city. Nyhaven is filled with people enjoying the relaxed atmosphere by the canal, jazz music and great food. Copenhagen Nyhaven is one of the most popular tourist attraction in Denmark. Great choice for ice cream while walking around Nyhaven Street. We came across this small but fabulous place when we were walking through the Nyhaven area. There was a varied range of ice cream flavors available and although they were tempting, we opted for some hot treats as the weather was cool. They also have some interesting looking churros, great churros, with chocolate or with soft ice cream or as is fresh and tasty Belgian waffle with warm chocolate sauce. Great in every sense. I was surprised how Indian food and culture have taken every corner of the world. The Copenhagen Metro is a 24-7 rapid transit system which uh, makes it easier to go to places. We return back to our hotel room, AC Hotel by Marriott Villa Sky as you can see. The structure is really impressive. Then next day after breakfast we went to a few more places as we had a whole day to spend natural history museum of denmark then we visited the king's garden in copenhagen sometimes referred to as rosenberg rosenberg castle garden is the oldest and most visited park in central Copenhagen, Denmark. A royal heritage set in the King's Garden in the heart of Copenhagen. Rosenberg Castle features 400 years of splendor, royal art treasures in the crown, jewels and more. The interiors are well preserved and invite 
you to take a journey in time. You can experience the king's private writing cabinet, his bathroom, and see wax figures of former royal inhabitants. We also visited zoo. In Copenhagen Zoo, you can meet more than 4,000 fascinating animals and travel between continents in just one day. A notable and highly visible feature of the zoo is the wooden observation tower. It offers views of the surrounding parklands and city. Another not to miss attraction in Copenhagen is the Wally Park. We are in the world's oldest theme park, Tivoli Gardens in Copenhagen, Denmark. Tivoli is the most visited theme park in Scandinavia. It is located directly in downtown Copenhagen, next to the central rail station for the city. The park is best known for its wooden roller coaster, a well-known swing ride, the Star Flyer. Built by the Australian company Funtime, it offers panoramic views of the city.
We entered Copenhagen from the water on a one hour canal cruise and see how the past and present merge as you travel along idly canals passing many of the city's most famous landmarks, old and new. Canal Tours Copenhagen is a wonderful way of seeing Copenhagen. Well, ladies and gentlemen, this is a fantastic and beautiful. It's one of the beautiful places here in Copenhagen. Uh, and I know for a fact that this canal itself was excavated. Well, right, ladies and gentlemen, is a bridge. And this is not just any bridge, this is the classic bridge here in Copenhagen. This bridge is for pedestrians and bicycles only. And it is one of the many, many new initiatives here in Copenhagen municipality uh, in order to make it the most bike friendly capital in the world, ladies and gentlemen. With this and many new initiatives, we have taken the lead. The military only has a small portion of it, the smallest island over here. But next year, two companies. Where? They're actually going to sell this island and everything. Well, it's three uh, islands in the Caribbean. We call them, we call these islands the Danish West Indies, and this was where they would receive until Father's Day. If you have arms, cameras, or children outside the boat and you don't feel like leaving, That is only because of Captain Danny, ladies and gentlemen, please give a big hand. That was no easy tour right there. Thank you, Captain Danny. To mention, this was Captain the fourth who felt uh, necessary to build a place where people could trade their uh, goods and other wares from all around the world. Today, it is a conference center as well. Finally, it was time for us to get on the cruise line. And it also happens to be the day for one of our group members' birthday. Happy birthday to you! Happy birthday to you! Happy birthday to you! And there is our Norwegian cruise ship waiting for us. It's huge! The cruise ship loading all the groceries and produce for the next 14 days. Entering our cruise. So for the next 14 days, this is our house. The first thing we like to do is the tour of the cruise ship. Cruise ship has great aqua park, ropes course, rock wall, shopping, casino, and many other activities on board. When it comes to food, a lot of choices. There are about three dining areas, complimentary dining areas, buffet, outdoor buffet, paid restaurants, and many other options. art gallery beautiful view outside and of course we all ladies love to shop cruise housekeeping made a mistake i think this is shower gel by the sink and the hand soap in the bathroom it's time for us to set everything into the room the empty bags can go under the bed. 
be sure to check all your um, room information like this room service mini bar where I was exploring room service and I came to know that they can also deliver complimentary continental breakfast which would include like fruits, yogurts, cold cereals, freshly baked breads, um, preserves and condiments, beverages, juices. So if specifically if you have kids this is very helpful. So um, for this particular Norwegian cruise you can just hang this um, breakfast service and you can check mark the items that you want um, only the cold breakfast is complimentary but for the special sec selections you have to pay like $7.95 seven really helpful for early excursion days on the way back home we again stop at Copenhagen and this time we decided to explore few more places we decided to visit Refn. I hope I'm actually pronouncing all this right, but it's hard to to pronounce sometimes the name where you not belong to. Refn is a street food market and urban area for startups, innovation, and creativity at in Copenhagen. By the water, which is perfect for enjoying your dishes and drink with front row views of Copenhagen Harbor. Here one can find more than 50 startups in the form of food stalls from all over, bars and creative workshops. And I'm glad we can always find Indian food almost everywhere all over the world now. Once we finished the cruise line, we um, stayed in London for a couple of days and then flew back to Florida. I hope you enjoyed watching this video. Please do like and comment and don't forget to subscribe to my channel for weekly videos. You can follow me on Facebook, Twitter, Instagram, Pinterest. All the links and anything that you are looking for uh, can be found under this video description. Thanks for watching and see you soon.